Now let's look at how we can adjust the appearance of our website. There's a lot of different things that we can control with appearance. The one we want to look at right now is the themes. Hovering over the appearance menu, themes will be the very top item. When you click on the themes link, it will take you to a page that will show you all of your currently installed themes. It will also highlight what your active theme is, that way you can see it. By default, WordPress currently comes with 2012, 2013, and 2014 as a theme. However, there are literally tens of thousands of themes out there that you can choose from to add and install. Some are free, and some you have to pay a fee for. You can also create your own themes. If you want to add a new theme, you can click on Add New. This will bring up a search form that you can use to find and filter based upon the themes that you're looking for. You can specify colors, the number of columns it supports, layout, features, etc. You will simply want to click the check boxes for the ones that you're interested in. You can also search based upon a keyword or click search. If you don't provide a keyword, it will filter based on what you've selected, but you'll get a lot more results. You'll notice that this is actually coming from the WordPress.org website, and as you get towards the bottom of the page, it will start to load additional ones for you. Click on the search link and adjust your filters. You will notice that you'll need to reselect any filters that you picked. For example, if you pick minimalist as a keyword, you'll notice that now you receive only 51 items. All of these themes that it returns are going to be your free themes that come on WordPress.org. If you want to go and find a commercial theme, you'll need to go to one of the commercial theme websites that sells them, like StudioPress, ThemeForest, etc. If you find a theme that you want to install, it's very simple to install that theme. For example, blank slate here has an install now. You can choose preview and details. Preview will show you what your website will look like. Details will bring up additional information about the theme. If you want to install it, simply click on install now. This will download the package, unpack it, and install it. It does not activate it. If you go to your themes page, you will see that's available to you, but it has not been activated. You will need to hover over it and click the activate button to activate that theme and make it the current theme that your WordPress site will use. All pages, all posts will use the same theme. You cannot define different themes for different sections of your website. If you want to delete a theme, simply click on the theme. You will then choose the delete button that's in the bottom right hand side. If you click OK, it will completely remove the theme from your website. This will delete the associated files. If you want to install that theme later on, you'll need to once again go and search, find the theme, download it, If you found this video tutorial helpful, please like and share it with others. If you want to keep up with other videos that are coming out, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook. That way you can get the most up-to-date information.